Now for a look at your top 10 headlines in just two minutes. One person was killed in a shooting outside of the Roseville Galleria. It happened in the parking garage there. Officers were able to arrest one suspect and have found the weapon they believe was used. There's no threat to shoppers. One man was killed in a shooting in South Stockton. It happened this morning after 10 a.m. Officers on scene found a car that slammed into a building causing a water and gas leak. One person was found with a gunshot wound. They were taken to the hospital where they later died. Police are now looking for a man in Nevada County who they say walked away from the Washington Ridge Conservation Camp. They say Malachi Thomas is six foot four and serving seven years for assault charges. He was last seen wearing his orange prison clothes. All evacuation orders have been lifted from the slow moving highway fire. The Nevada County Sheriff's Office says some roads are still closed as crews work to mop up the fire, but otherwise people can return home. The fire burned about 40 acres. A community meeting is planned for Monday about when and where sexually violent predator William Stevenson will be released. Liberty Healthcare is holding a meeting at 9.30 a.m. and people can either participate in person or write in online. We have a link to that form on our website. The governor of Hawaii is now promising criminal penalties for anyone that's trying to take advantage of the tragedy and the people impacted. Close to 2,000 buildings were destroyed. 500 more were damaged. Homeowners in parts of northwestern Canada are now working to create defensible space around their home as wildfires inch closer from the north. The town of Yellowknife has already been evacuated as the country's worst wildfire season continues. Idaho stabbing suspect Brian Koberger appeared in court as his defense team is asking for the trial to be paused. They claim that there are more unidentified DNA samples that the prosecution hasn't handed over. With six weeks left until the trial, the defense hoped they could convince the judge to delay and allow for more time for discovery. It's a new search and destroy order for a species of hornet that's native to Asia seen in parts of the southeast. The bugs are killers of honeybees, which could harm crop yields in states like Georgia and South Carolina. This bug is a cousin of the murder hornet, last seen in 2021 in Washington state. Yellow County Supervisor and former Woodland Mayor Gary Sandy died yesterday, according to a statement from the mayor of West Sacramento. Sandy worked with communities in Yellow County, particularly in northern parts of West Sacramento, and was an advocate for education and youth services. And that's a look at your top 10 headlines in just two minutes.